it's all about what's hype over there. You know, what's exactly what's hyped in the States. Mm. Let's imitate it here. Oh, it's sweats. Oh, sweats it is. Well, it's been, it's been like that for a few years. Yeah, exactly. And it's always been like that even from before. Mm. So we don't have anyone that's daring enough to do something different. Uh, think about human error. Mm. Uh, she's trying very hard to be different than what's in front of you, right? You're getting sweatshirts and, and hoodies and stuff, but there's something different to a it. Unique element to it. But I'm not talking about you just see we will only grow if we have options mm. if everybody's the same there's no options all we're doing is just replacing this sweatshirt with another sweatshirt true if we have options people who are going above and beyond and doing something different then we will have something different to wear mm. but now all we have is basically what the market dictates if everybody decides it's hoodies then all we're getting is hoodies so the only thing that we're gonna be wearing is fucking hoodies and t-shirts mm. But until someone comes in with something totally different, for example, Gaelic, Gaelic takes uh, chances. Yeah, the, yeah, the, the new, the the did the season. The, the did the season. I don't know if he announced it or showed it yet. I think he did, right? The, he put a garage uh, post. only post. Okay, so yeah, 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 yeah so people yeah. didn't see it yet. Yeah, yeah. The, the, the ones we have to go to. Uh, okay. yes, yes, the one he's forced to go to Dubai. Exactly. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I received the same message as well. I was like, okay. Yeah. Uh, what's the name? Um, but Gaelic takes chances. Gaelic takes chances. Yes. And he's very brave at it. And at yeah. the same time, they do like. Oh, I am wearing Gaelic. Yeah, exactly. Totally they do implement their own unique, you know, print. Yeah, like as this well. looks like Sedu, but this one also says Gaelic, Gaelic, exactly. Gaelic, Gaelic, Gaelic. Which is amazing when you actually see it and realize. Like, okay, so really we dope. need more people to start taking chances on the different styles. Like, why am I just in hoodies? Why am I just in leather jackets? And mm. Why do they all look the same with just different branding on it? But give me something different. Give mm. me something outside the box. Give me a different color. Give me something wild. We don't have people that try to do something wild. We have people that are trying to copy what's wild. Yeah, but the the general market here specifically, I don't think they go for edgy. I don't, they, they rarely go for something different. A lot of people do not are are not invested in the the um, th- their fashion as much as we expect them to be. They see people on on social media with oversized t shirts and and sweatpants. They go like, okay, that's what I'm getting. That's Regardless if it's a, a if it's a good brand, if it's a good quality, as long as it has the same silhouette look, that's what I'm getting. like the 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 cheap ass uh, hip hop uh, hip hop hip hop store hip-hop. clothes. Hmm. You're gonna get the same cut, and they're gonna go for it. Here's the thing: um, the biggest issue with most of the local brands that we have is ROI. They want to return on their exactly. investment. That's, what that's I was why. Yeah. yeah, I understand that. So they want to play it safe in terms of what is the market going to. Exactly. I know something that's going to sell. But if the market decides that you know what the wilder something is, the more people will want it, then everybody will start thinking outside the box. But as long as there's no demand for something outside the box, as long as nobody takes the risk. <laughs>